So here we have the uh, 2014 Audi Q5 TDI Quattro Tiptronic. Had a fun week driving this around. Wanted to do a little walk around and uh, tour of the inside of the car. So again, we've got a little SUV here, uh, but just been blown away by the performance and the handling and that kind of thing. Obviously, you have a little higher driving position because it's an SUV, but it's got 20 inch rims. It's got uh, 428 pound feet of torque in that engine. It's got the S-Line styling with paddle shifters and all kinds of other sporty goodies that uh, really make it handle good, handle well and, and look good as well. So again, we've got big 20 inch rims on there. Because this is a uh, press car, it says TDI clean diesel. Most of the uh, regular consumer cars don't have the graphics on the side. Get an idea of the, you know, again, small kind of SUV shape. It's got a big uh, trunk and back area here with the automated lift gate. Uh, the car's running right now. I don't know if you can hear. It's very quiet. You know, it's just like any car. If you stand right next to it, you can hear the engine a little bit, but certainly nothing crazy like the diesels of before. Again, this is a TDI. This is Audi's clean diesel technology, uh, which gives you about 20% lower emissions than a gas engine and uh, this gets 27 miles per gallon average, uh, which is great for a big, uh, not a big SUV, but a, a luxury SUV with all the accessories this has inside. So again, we have the boot inside here, the trunk space. You got a pass through here uh, to the rear seat, uh, power adapter. Uh, I'm not sure this is to pull the seat back to create a whole uh, flat bed all the way back. Okay, so let's take a look at the interior. Nice, big, spacious back seat. And something I love about this car, pretty much the whole roof is a sunroof. So right now we've got half the roof open, uh, as you can see but the back half is also a glass panel. So what you get is, when this is shut, so this is with the sunroof shut, and excuse the dirt there, but you still have just a whole roof of glass almost okay so now in the uh, the driver's seat here we have the uh, the Audi S line kind of Formula One inspired steering wheel we have uh, paddle shifters which I think is kind of funny uh, normally you would think it's funny to have paddle shifters on a diesel SUV but in this case you can really use them uh, you've got Audi's great MMI uh, computer technology and navigation and cell phone. Uh, the car is even a 3G hotspot so that you can hook up wireless devices and the car is the hotspot. The car is connected with uh, whoever the cellular provider is. Uh, you've got satellite radio, all the, bells and, all the bells and whistles here and also complete control of uh, what's called Audi Drive Select which allows you to customize all the different options of the uh, car, uh, including vehicle settings, driver assist, AC, servicing, all that kind of stuff. Everything is controlled from there. Uh, very comfortable driving position. Again, very sporty car. Uh, I find with the TDI models that it's best to keep it in the sport mode as opposed to kind of the normal drive mode that gets you uh, higher shift points and uh, more revs and kind of uh, compensates for any slowness or inadequacy the diesel engine has. The Tiptronic and the uh, sports setting makes up for that. So again, we are here inside the 2014 Audi Q5 TDI 
Quattro Tiptronic and uh, very impressed. There is no